Hey friends, how's it going? Ash here with Gen Sense. Today we're gonna to be taking a look at a shower gel. First one that I've taken a look at on this channel. And I had to make it a good one. And it is a good one. It's Creed. Green Irish Tweed in shower gel form. Yeah, look at that unmistakable Creed shape. Only in a plastic bottle this time. This is not an inexpensive shower gel. It is $100 at retail price, and the size of this bad boy, 6.66 fluid ounces. I didn't make that up. That's actually how they have it advertised, 6.66 fluid ounces. We got lots to talk about. Let's go ahead and jump into this and break down this here shower gel. So as I mentioned guys, $100, that's the retail price for this bad boy right here. And that is <laughs> not cheap, obviously, because we are ultimately talking about something that you just use to wash yourself off, that realistically you can get you know, a shower gel for three bucks at Walmart and cheaper if you really don't care what brand you're getting. But this one's special because this one is from Creed and it's Green Hours Tweed, which is of course, one of my favorite fragrances of all time. Check that out, they just, go together so nicely. Now this bottle right here is going to certainly look better in your shower than just a standard run of the mill shower gel. It's really, really cool, especially if you know what it is, you know what's inside here, that makes it even better. So Green Iris Tweed, the fragrance, has notes of lemon verbena, iris, violet leaf ambergris, and sandalwood. Mmm, smells so good. Like a walk in the Irish countryside as Creed says in order to sell the bottle to you. But it really is very nice, green, fresh, brisk, gentlemanly, timeless. That's what this is. I guess let's go ahead and take a look at the presentation a little bit closer and then we'll start talking about the shower gel, whether it's worth the price tag and how much you can find it for discounted. The presentation here is really nice, which is a good thing because if you're spending $100 on shower gel, it better be at least nice. So the box is gonna look really familiar to you if you've ever purchased a Creed fragrance. It looks super similar to the boxes that their fragrances come in nowadays. So you have the Creed logo right here at the top, nice gold foiling on that. You have the name of the fragrance right here in the middle, again, just like you'll see on the boxes for the fragrances. And it has that sort of velvety feel to the label. Down here, you can see that it is a shower gel, 200 mils, 6.66 fluid ounces. <laughs> and then here on the front, like always, from father to son since 1760. And if you speak a different language than English or French, they've got you covered on the back. We've got a little information on the top of the box. Again, the Creed logo right there on the top. And then on the bottom, you'll find your badge code, and your barcode. And here we've got the bottle, which I actually think looks really nice. Feels good in the hand, kind of a, a rubberized grip to the plastic here. Again, you've got that Creed logo right here impressed into the bottle, the Creed name, Green Irish Tweed, and then shower gel. Mine is a, sort of a misprint bottle, looks like. The shower gel, it's not all there. So you can see what I'm talking about right there. On the back of the bottle, it says Creed right here. Looks really nice. On the bottom, you've got your badge code and it's printed the exact same way you're gonna find it on the bottles of the fragrances. On the top of the cap, you have that Creed crest and this actually opens like so. You unscrew it. Ooh, it smells good. And then this is how it's going to look when it's unscrewed. So you just have this little uh, this little hole right here, essentially. And the shower gel is, it's not really like a gel. It's actually kind of liquid-like. So you unscrew it and then you just turn it up and you kind of do this deal and it goes <laughs> and just shoots out little liquid streams of shower gel. I'm not going to uh, do that for you here on camera, but yeah, that's exactly what happens. You give it a little squeeze and it just goes so the consistency here, like I said, much more liquidy than most shower gels. Most shower gels, they've got that very kind of viscous look to them. This one doesn't. 
So you have to give this one a, a few good squeezes into a loofah or a uh, washcloth, but you get a really nice lather. So how does this one smell? It smells like Green Irish Tweed. What a surprise. It really does. It doesn't have any like soapiness to it, so it doesn't smell like a version of Green Irish Tweed that's been turned into a soap. You know, it doesn't have that kind of chemically undertone to it. It just really smells like Green Irish Tweed, which is freaking fantastic. I absolutely love using the shower gel in the shower. Love it, absolutely. It smells just like the fragrance. It's really fresh and green when you take the cap off and give it just a little whiff. Unmistakable, right away. The lemon verbena is right there. As soon as you put this into a loofah, as soon as you put it into a washcloth, whatever, you pick it up right away. Really nice pop of green freshness immediately. It's very bright, eye-opening. Fantastic. Obviously, with this being a shower gel, you don't get much of that dry down of Green Irish Tweed. It's basically the opening. So imagine the opening, you know, first five minutes of this fragrance. That's what's going on here when you use this one. Now, it doesn't last. It is a shower gel. So I don't know that you should really expect it to last all that long once you're out of the shower, but it doesn't. Pretty much right after you towel off and hop out of the shower, you can put your nose right up next to your skin, breathe in deeply and pick up uh, pretty much nothing. If you use a whole lot of the shower gel, then maybe it will last a little bit on your skin, but not really. Yes, this is a perfume shower gel. No, this is not a perfume. This is not going to last on your skin all day. At best, like I mentioned, if you use a bunch of it, you might be able to very faintly smell like a warm version of the opening of Green Irish Tweed that is just one millimeter off your skin. So essentially when you buy this, you're buying this to enjoy in the shower. You're not buying this to have the scent of Green Irish Tweed linger on you all day. At least for me, that's not the case. It is though decently moisturizing, no issues with um, dry skin, anything like that. So no problems there whatsoever. It rinses off cleanly, smells fantastic. And the packaging, like I said, is gonna look really, 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 really good in your shower. Now, the big hang up on this, the price. $100 is a lot of freaking money for a shower gel, a whole lot of money. Because again, this is 200 milliliters in here. To put that into context, a more typical size of a shower gel that you're going to find at Walmart or Target or someplace like that, it's going to be 500 milliliters. Yeah, so two and a half times larger than this. You're getting a full 300 more milliliters in your more typical size, and <laughs> you're saving a whole lot of money. I guarantee you, you can go to Target and buy the most expensive body wash there it will not come remotely close to the cost of this, but you already knew that. So me personally, I did not buy this at full retail. $100, that's a bit too much, but I did still spend more than what most people would realistically spend on a shower gel. I bought it from FragranceNet. They had this for $58.49 after a 35% off discount. So I saved almost half the price and it was still almost 60 bucks. Technically, I saved about 41.5%, but 50% sounds better. Obviously, I'm going to use this entire thing. Like I said, I love the way that it smells. It's great. It doesn't have any weird undertones or overtones with the fragrance of Green Irish Tweed. It's just Green Irish Tweed only made into a shower gel. Yeah, it's exactly what they're saying it is. Do I wish it had a little more consistency and wasn't as runny? Yeah, but whatever. Am I ever going to buy this again? Yeah, I'm not sure. Maybe if I want to treat myself and on occasion take a blissfully green Irish tweed shower, yes, I'll buy it again. Is it something that I'm gonna have in my shower forever and ever? No. But if you have the extra money and you love a particular Creed fragrance that they make a shower gel of, I think you can safely pick it up and you're going to have an awesome shower and it's gonna smell amazing. So there are my thoughts on Creed Green Irish Tweed Shower Gel. Is it the most expensive shower gel I've ever used? Yes, it is. Do I regret the purchase? 
No, I don't think so. I'm really glad to be able to try it out and I really can't hate on the smell. So there we go guys, Creed Green Irish Tweed Shower Gel. Dollar dollar bills going down the drain, literally. If you have ever used a Creed shower gel, let me know what you think about them in the comments below. As always, thanks for hanging out with me today. Thanks for all your support. Stay safe out there, and I'll see you tomorrow with another fragrance and or soap video. See you guys. Oh, I kicked the desk.